Alright, I just want to show off in the daytime again this new uh, Thunder Power 40 amp DSC I just put on here. And I like its position because, like I said last night, it looks like a little radiator under there now. It's really cool. I wish my, um, I could have put my other speed control under there too, if it was as small, but that's just something for you guys to look at. Now, next, we can uh, go ahead and fuel up the. <coughs> Got the throttle and everything set up. The limits on the governor reset. And then we're going to um, disable the governor and set up the uh, throttle curve and make sure the head speed isn't um, going uh, over. the RPMs that we want to set up for. So they can uh, tack it while I run it and finish setting this bird up. Hopefully we get the fire up today. Uh, thanks John Doe, Doc Audio, everybody out there, Heli 770, everybody that helped me out with this year project again. <laughs> and uh, Yeah, you see how I made this helicopter where I'm uh, don't have to almost have any field equipment. My pump is strapped on the jug. My power comes from the starter. Also, when I built this helicopter, I put that motor in. I had to uh, modify the skid plate, not the skid plate, the base plate. The cylinder was blocking up there, so I had to cut out that bar. But the way my skid has this reinforcement going across there, it'll keep uh, the frame supported. Yeah, see, I cut out this bar right going across there. Hey, finally I can see that the motor mount too, the revolution from the bottom and move it on side. Okay, thanks for watching everybody. Next video we'll be firing this baby up. So stay tuned.